Hey guys, Martin here with from Aviation Fargo and behind me right here we have an early model North American B-25 Mitchell. Uh, this aircraft was bought at an estate sale in Arizona by the late Jerry Beck in the condition you see right now, pretty much this exact condition, and it was actually repaired to flyable condition and flown in this condition up to Wapiton where it sat in storage for 20 years. And um, the Fargo Air Museum has finally received this aircraft and um, we do plan on restoring it to static display for uh, in beautiful condition. And this aircraft right here, most of the internals have been removed, but it would have two 50 caliber machine guns on each of these side windows here. The aircraft would also have 250 caliber machine guns here in the rear turret. And uh, as you can see, the aircraft does not have the rudders, um, wings, and uh, propellers attached to the aircraft. The wings are over here, uh, next to this hangar here. The propellers we have on a stand inside. And um, the rudders, I am not currently sure where, where they are. But this B-25 had to be transported um, from Wapiton on the interstate. Quite a big load to transport on the interstate. As you can see, it's in quite rough condition. Another unique, um, another unique fact about this aircraft is it actually was featured in a movie, which um, in the nose of the aircraft here, the original nose, nose section of the aircraft was replaced with this sort of fiberglass piece which was used in the this aircraft. And when they did fly fly this aircraft, when they did fly this aircraft in, they were not able to retract the landing gear on the aircraft, so they had to con so they had to fly it um, from Arizona to Wapiton with the gear down. And over here, in the bomb bay, as you can see, it's missing various of its. Um, various of its important components and all the wiring's a mess. And this is a permanent exhibit at the Fargo Air Museum. So, um, thanks for watching guys, and remember to comment, rate, and subscribe.